Quick heads up, this video is about testosterone. I'm going to make it really short. We all know what testosterone does. It's just like growth hormone. It promotes muscle growth. It helps you build muscle a lot faster. You want to maintain your testosterone levels high. Naturally, if you have low testosterone levels, then you really want to watch this video. If you have good to average or very good testosterone levels, you want to keep them at that level, all right? Um, testosterone, pretty much, we all know, is found mostly in males. Women have it too, but it's not as much. It, you know, gives you that deep voice, it, you know. You know, it's pretty. It's very good for you know building muscle. It does a lot of other things, but in the bodybuilding world, it's the most one of the most important hormones to build muscle. You want to keep your, your testosterone levels high through nutrition. You know, I mean, if you're using steroids and all that, you know, that's on you. I mean, I'm not judging you. I'm not knocking you. I just don't want the side effects. That's uh, that's why I stay away from that. But there there are ways to you know keep your test testosterone levels high. A natural way. I mean, just eat foods that are high in zinc. I'm gonna make it really short and simple. Just eat foods that are high in zinc. Don't ask me why. I did my research. You can look it up if you want. Bananas, oysters, avocados, and stuff like that. Healthy fats. You need your healthy fats. Your body does not. Your, your testosterone levels will drop if you're not eating enough, enough healthy fats. Healthy fats are found in um, avocado, like I mentioned. Nuts, cashews, almonds, peanuts. I know they're expensive, but hey, it's worth it. Olive oil. You know, healthy fats. You need healthy fats. You know, no trans fats, of course, you know, to have high testosterone levels. Your body uses the fats that you eat to make testosterone, you know. So, every day, I mean, every day, don't go a day without eating either banana, that's high in zinc, you know, banana, or, or nuts. You want to eat nuts every day. You need those healthy fats, especially if you're trying to build muscle. You need testosterone. Otherwise, your protein and your carbs will just do the minimum job. And, you know, it won't really be testosterone pretty much... You can have a good eating diet, a good diet, a good bodybuilding meal, you know, every three hours. But if your testosterone levels are low, you're not going to build muscle, you know what I'm saying? It's like having a whole bunch of workers, but you don't have the architect to direct, you know, what's going to, you know, what's, you know, what's going to take place, you know, in building the, what, you know, whatever you're working on. So you need your testosterone levels high. Keep them high if they're already up there. If they're not up there, that's another reason why you want to eat more bananas, more nuts and stuff like that avocados, I know they're expensive, but hey, bodybuilding is expensive, um, oysters, you know, stuff like that, uh, yeah, man, eat foods that are high in zinc, um, also, workout, during, during your first 40 to 45 minutes of your workout, that's when your body releases the most testosterone, if you're doing compound movements, if you're doing movements that, re that recruit a lot of muscle fibers, like squats, deadlifts, bench press, and stuff like that, your body's gonna you know, release testosterone because it's going to be under that stress, you know. But after 45 minutes, testosterone levels drop, cortisol goes up. Well, you, you should all know that by now. So limit your, your workouts to intense 40 to 45 minute sessions at most, right? And um, every day, no matter what body part you're working on, every workout day, make sure you're doing compound movements. And make sure you're doing at least bench pressing, at least squats or deadlifts, you know. Something, for example, a, a friend of mine just likes doing picking a day for abs and, I don't know, biceps or some shit. He does biceps, triceps on one day, right? Which I don't recommend, but if you do that, you know, it's on you. I recommend him at least to do squats on that day or do something that's a compound movement so that he could release testosterone, you know, during that workout session, you know? Uh, yeah, man, so just keep them, keep them levels high. Keep testosterone high, you know? Because you could be in an anabolic phase and if you have low testosterone levels, you're not going to see, you know, you know, a lot of results. Eat your nuts every day, every day. Don't skip a day where you're not eating nuts or foods that are high in zinc, all right?